Once upon a time, there was a boy named Kolya. He lived with his baba, or grandmother, deep in the woods. It was getting close to Malanka, or Ukrainian New Year's, and Baba was preparing the cottage for fun festivities. She instructed Kolya to get some wood for the stove. He insisted on wearing the beautiful white mittens Baba had knit for him for Christmas. Off he went, admiring his new mittens and noticing how warm they were keeping his hands, even from the north wind. Once he had gathered some wood in his sleigh, he decided it was time to take a break. In keeping with Ukrainian tradition, he liked to dress up as a bear, or Vedmij, for New Year's. He thought this would be a great time to practice his bear growl. Grrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrr
You can come in as long as you get off from on top of the mitten. The animals rearranged themselves to make sure there was enough room for the rabbit. At this point, the mitten was so stretched, it hardly looked like a mitten at all. Who should come along but a big black bear? He saw a white lump ahead. Is that my cousin, the polar bear? He thought, puzzled. As he approached the lump, he could see that it was not a polar bear at all, but a group of animals seeking shelter together. I don't suppose you would have room for me, said the bear. They could not possibly fit a bear, but in a wave of genius, the wolf offered a plan. The animals pushed on the lining of the mitten as hard as they could. With enough might, they stretched out the mitten just enough to squeeze in the bear. There is always a way to include everyone, said the wolf. Alas, Kolya was on his way home, retracing his exact steps because he had misplaced one of his mittens. His Baba was right, he thought to himself. She had suggested he choose a different color than white, so that they would not get lost in the snow. Kicking a stick in frustration, he nearly stumbled over the lost mitten. My mitten! My mitten! He gleamed. Noticing the size, he realized the mitten was not the same as he left it. Peeking inside, he could not believe what he found. He ran to the cottage and found his Baba. Baba! Baba! He shouted excitedly. The animals! In my mitten! All of them! Curious to find out what her dear grandson was referring to, she came along with him. Together, they found the mitten housing the burrowed animals. <laughs> A Malanka miracle! Baba exclaimed. Kolya and Baba filled the sleigh with fresh baking and decorations and brought them to the mitten. Room for two more? Baba asked. Looking at one another, the animals knew what to do and stretched the lining with one final push. The mitten expanded just enough and they cheered for Baba and Kolya to come in. They celebrated Malanka, the Ukrainian New Year, together, warm and happy.